good day to everyone and welcome to this video tutorial this video is in continuation to the earlier video the journal characteristics of allergy it will be the part two in this short video we will discuss brief history and contributions made by prominent physiologist psychologists towards the field of psychology you know over the years psychologists have made numerous contributions to our understanding of these fascinating organisms that's called as algae and in this video tutorial we will see the brief history of psychology and the contributions made by the psychologists as you know the history of the algae is very old and they being diverse organisms they have a very old history and it's reflected in chinese literature as well as in roman and greek literature they have been differently named greek called it as phycos romans called it as, it as fucus chinese named it sao and there it had an aesthetic significance also ancient hawaiians called them as limu where it was used as food and north coast of france in 12th century used algae as a manure and in 17th century in japan and chinese now it's used for agar making so it has commercial importances in this video we will try to understand the world renowned and some of the indian psychologists and their contributions you will see mostly the literature the evidences of the literature in psychology is since 18th century because it's the beginning of the invention and development of the microscope and before that the thrust was on the macroscopic types of the algae many european biologists took interest in the study of algae after the invention of microscope that's after 18th century few prominent ones are roth turner ling hessel brown griffith berry and to name others also strasburger and the prominent one is f e fritch and uh, rich is also there cotton well caught there are number of the world renowned psychologists who have greatly contributed towards these are some of the names with the dates and their contributions will mostly uh, focus on the contributions of the indian psychologists towards understanding the psychology but before that up to 18th century as i mentioned uh major interest were on the macroscopic forms but since uh, that time four genres or groups fucus ulva conviva uh, conferva and corallina were named it was the contribution of the f e fridge in 1907 who made uh, sub aerial and fresh water algae is discussed disc described sub aerial and fresh water algae from ceylon and he also published classification of algae in his book the book which is here that book is the structure and the reproduction of the algae a prominent uh, british biologist who made contribution towards the psychology and published a book structure and reproduction of the algae 
which comes in two volumes. But in Indian context, the contributions of the Indian phycologists will discuss few prominent Indian phycologists and their contributions. Indian phycologists started their work on algae from 1919 onwards. A Ghosh in 1919 to 32, he was a pioneer of phycology in India. He conducted research on blue green algae of Burma and Punjab. But there are the sum of the prominent, few prominent Indian phycologists. We will discuss them one by one. M.O.P. Iyengar, Dishkachari, Krishnamurti, Randava, Subramaniam, V. Subramaniam, Chauhan, Adhikari. These are some of the prominent Indian phycologists who have contributed immensely towards the field of phycology. This is the group photo of Indian algologists who have played significant role in the identification and their ecology, physiology, life cycle of algae growing in India and abroad. The prominent one, if you see the Randava is here, Iyengar is there. These are all the Indian algologists who have made up their mark in field of algology in India as well as abroad. The father of the modern Indian phycology is M.O.P. Iyengar. He was born in Madras and he worked on morphology, taxonomy, cytology and reproductive biology of Indian algae, especially Spirogyra, Volvocalis at the University of Madras. He was a student. He was basically a student for, he did PhD uh, under uh, the guidance, mentorship of F.E. Fridge at London. London and he worked on life history of cylindro capsa and a microdiction. Iyengar who has contributed towards the algae, Indian algae to his credit he discovered new species. One species was the Fristilla tuberosa, a terrestrial algae and he named it in honor of F.E. Fridge his PhD mentor at London. The, the Fristilla, Fristilla tuberosa, first discovered by uh, Iyengar, and also he discovered these species, uh, Chara uh, and in addition to this, he was the first president of Phycolog Phycological Society of India. And his huge collections of specimens, herbarium sheets, are lying in the Department of Botany, University of Madras. For his voluminous contributions on Indian algae, he is called as the father of modern Indian phycology. This is the species, new uh, species, which were discovered by Iyengar. One is uh, Gilbert's Cynthia Grandis Iyengar and Ecbella Cystopsis Indica. These are the species which were discovered by the Iyengar and he is named as the father of modern Indian phycology. Who is named as the father of modern Indian phycology? His name is Iyengar. Then comes his student, Professor T. V. Dishkachari. 1919 to 2005, born in Tripathi, and he was a student of M.O.P. Iyengar. He presented unpublished papers of his teacher. He published research papers, namely monograph on Sinophyta, taxonomy and biology of blue green algae, marine plants and volvocalis, published rhodophyta and pheophyta, and in addition to this. 
he made a monumental atlas of indian diatoms in five volumes studies on life history of red algae he discovered new genera one genera is this uh, montinilla in addition to this he was a chief editor of phycos which is a journal and for his journal on uh, on algae for his lifetime contributions in phycology he was honored by phycological society of america also all specimens collections are present in the university of madras so he was the student of father of indian phycology aying then one more prominent phycologist is professor krishnamurthy 1921 to 2014 professor v krishnamurthy was also the student of mop ayengar and k dreev baker from british a british phycologist he did a pioneering phycology was a pioneering phycologist in india also he established krishnamurthy institute of algology k i a at chennai so these in addition to doing the research they have institutionalized the phycology kia has the largest library in tamil nadu on algal studies he started the seaweed research and utilization association to encourage research on seaweed in india he published journal seaweed research utilization his publications are on ectocorpsi and porphyra physico chemical properties of carrageenan extracted from sarcoma he discovered some new species of algae from india he published numerous books on rhodophycy of india so again a great phycologist who has contributed and who has institutionalized the phycology in india by establishing kia at ms randava 1932 to 59 he was born in punjab and then he got selected in ics indian civil service he was a chief editor of phycos he published papers on zygnemesi oidogonelles vachiriesi of punjab and up he recorded 70 species of zygnemesi discovered new species among them these are the new species and he also found new types of acnate formations in vacheria a prominent bureaucrat also but first a prominent phycologist then why bardwaj in 1928 to 36 before that biswas 1922 to 26 he wrote algal flora of east india assam and bengal why bardwaja 1928 to 36 the bardwaj in the big picture in the middle of the picture he gave blue green algae of up and also established school of algology at banaras hindu university he discovered these species and two species of these genera so bardwaj also institutionalized the besides discovering the new species he also initialized the algae and made in uh, school of algology at banaras hindu university arun singh 1938 to 59 arun singh 1938 to 59 and he was student of bardwaja at bhu he discovered alocera worked on cyanobacteria and uses in agricultural fields and he also discovered algae from up and he made a life cycle of freschilia tuberosa and and other two species and he is also known for reclamation of the usher lands in india where salt 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 crustaceans is more and he is known for 
reclamation of those lands also. In addition to this, the last in our generally here is the V.D. Chauvan, 1933 to 2022, born at Bhavannagar. He has worked on taxonomy and chemical characterization of alginic acid, estimation of sargassum, reported new genres of sargassum, and organized several seaweed resource surveys from 1961 to 91, made an accurate estimate of sargassum crop of 4,000 metric tons dry weight from Gulf of Kutch. And he also handled another project, the drugs from sea. Dr. Chavan is known for his work for chemical characterization of many products which have the industrial uses and which also have the uses in drugs. Dear friends, the purpose of this video, short video, was to acknowledge the contributions of Indian phycologists towards the field of phycology. I hope Video will inspire young minds towards this field of sinus. As you know, algae plays a crucial role in global ecosystem and have an important application in various industries. Thank you for the patient listening. Be safe till we upload the next video. Thank you very much.